Hi guys, welcome back to Estella Wilson Creations. I have a Dollar Tree haul for you, um, so I cannot wait to share everything that I got. But before we get into the haul, I do want to let you know I am on TikTok. Over there on TikTok, you will see like some haul stuff. You're also going to see like just everything that you see here, home decor. But it's a different side of me. To me, it's more playful. Um, more musical and just a different side to me. So if you're interested in getting to know more about me, I'm going to put my TikTok name. It's Estella Wilson Creations over there as well. So I hope you guys drop over there and let me know that you're there and that you saw my videos. So let's just get into the Dollar Tree haul. Huh? I guess I'm going to show you the earrings first. I found some new earrings. I got this one with a little bow. It says love. You can use it for Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, or just because. So I got that one. And then, of course, I had to get these little crosses. So I got these. Um, these are silver. I think everything I got is silver there. They might have had gold, but all of these are silver that I got. So I got the crosses. And then, yeah, I just got the regular diamonds so i picked these up and for a dollar each you know my job only lets me wear studs i can't wear like dangly earrings so that's why i picked these up um my niece she wanted some liquid eyeliner so i actually got this one which is black brown uh cble 431 and then i also got black so i did get her both of these she asked for black but i thought she might like that one as well so I picked up both colors. And then the next item I got was this one. It's a blueberry pancake um, candle. It is blue, not in my color scheme, but it was a dollar. And I thought it smelled really good. So I picked it up. Maybe my niece will use this one or maybe in the kitchen on Sundays when we make breakfast or Mondays on our day off. Maybe I can like this one. So that's why I got that. The next item I got was two brushes. Um, they had this one and then this one as well. These are just new brushes. They also come with the cap, so good for travel. Um, but this one's purple. And then they had a pink color, a green, and a blue. And we always like the color coat ones um, a lot of times because, you know, my husband can get one, I can get one Jalissa, and I will have one extra one. And I change my brushes out a lot. As soon as they start to look kind of bad, I kind of change them out. I probably change them out more than you need to. I think you're supposed to change them out like monthly or something, but I change mine out a lot. So I got these. I thought these were a good buy. And then the next item I got were just two more of these candle lighters. I use these for all of my candles. No longer would I ever use a regular lighter. I would buy these. Um, I've tried refilling them and I can't. Now I'm not sure if these are refillable, the ones from the Dollar Tree. But my husband has one that's refillable and it's really, really hard to do. So at least for me. So I didn't get that. I did pick up these pots. They're like in this light gray color and they're just planters, but they come in a four piece. And I had seen a DIY and I thought, I can recreate that with these little planters. So I'm gonna put this in my DIY stuff and hopefully use these later. I got this right here as a measuring cup. I actually got this for work, but then I ended up placing another order. So I might just leave this here in my house, but here is a four cup measuring cup. And um, this is gonna come in handy when I'm like doing little stuff and I don't wanna use my glass one. So I'm just gonna probably take this upstairs. Okay, the next thing I found were some socks. Um, I'm gonna show you what I found first and I was like, yep. So these are by the Juncture, Juncture brand, Women's Athletic Socks. And I like these, I like the quality of the sock. So this is a yellow and blue on um, both of them. This one has more blue, this one has more yellow. So I did pick that up. You get two pairs for a dollar. And then I picked this one up. It's a pink and gray, the color flip flops as well. And then I did see these black ones and I was like, yep, I'm getting these too. I love wearing a nice black sock as well, even in the summer, especially to work. I love wearing these. So I did pick those up as well. 
Okay, so that's everything on this side. The next thing I got were these, and these are some little wreaths. They're wreath rings, but these are tiny. And I thought these could be the ears to my Mickey. I want to do a DIY like Mickey head, and I wanna do it with greenery. And I've been having it in my mind for a while, and I just, one, haven't found the little rings and I always have the big circles the 18 inches or the 20 inches but now I have the little rings so I just need to try to find a lot of floral and I hear Dollar Tree has a lot of floral none of my Dollar Trees have got it yet and they're so understaffed like they have no staff there so the shelves are pretty bare so I'm just waiting and once I can find some floral maybe you'll see a Mickey farmhouse greenery um wreath so that's for that okay what else did i find i did find some yellow flowers these are just called wow flowers um and they're in this really really yellow you guys know i am doing my living room and kitchen and lemons and yellow is the color and i thought these can go on a wreath but the more i got to looking at them um i might even get a new wreath for one of the wall picture frames that I have but I definitely am going to use these upstairs so pretty and I'm glad I found those for a dollar the next item I found was this and it's a garden flag and I'm not sure I don't think I have this now originally I wasn't going to get it because it has a blue black round but I saw someone uh, cut it out and was able to use the home sweet home. So without the blue gingham behind it, it will fit my home decor just fine. I just don't use blue in my home decor. And everything that the Dollar Tree brought out this year has just like blue background, blue gingham in the background. So if you too want the lemon and not the blue gingham, maybe this DIY will work for you. So I did pick up two. One, in case I mess something up, or two, if I want to use it in a different way. I probably need to see if I have more lemon stuff somewhere else. I didn't do that yet. So I got that. And then the next item I got, this is for work, this yellow rectangular tablecloth. So I am going to... Um, I am going to use this on a now hiring table. I don't know why I think it's yellow is summery and this is what I'm gonna do. We have yellow balloons and red balloons. So I don't know, we're gonna use this yellow tablecloth for that. So I got that, which needs to go to work. Okay, um, I did find some other items. I found these confettis. This confetti has like palm trees and I don't know what kind of animal that is. Some kind of sea animal. I don't know what the blue animal is. There's some kind of animal in there. And then it has pineapples in this one. Nope, this one's just a circle. And the pineapples and the flowers is in this one. I don't know if you guys can see that. That's circles and then little palm trees. So I got that one. And then this one has flamingos and like some suns. And then just some circles. And this one has those little... I don't even know what you call these. You can see them. And then some flowers, so. Very, very tropical Hawaiian. So, got those, gonna put that in my stash. Okay, the next item I found was this Descendants Wicked Volume 3 book. Um, I got this too. This is gonna be so bad. I wanna eventually do some Descendants projects and I thought this book it only cost a dollar would be good to use some of the images because look at the images the whole book is filled with like descendant images so I thought that would be a good book to you know I don't know tear up is that bad okay I did get a Mother's Day card my mom loves baking so this one says, Mom's Recipe for Love. Two parts patience, one part strength, one dash of laughter, wisdom and tender to taste. Combine all ingredients and mix well. Serve with warmth and grace. It takes many special qualities to make a mom like you. A mom who's loved so very much. Today, 
and all year through. Happy Mother's Day. So that's what that says. It's super cute. And uh, yeah, I'm in love. Okay, the next item I got was not even thinking about getting them. And look what I saw at the store. So this is the first one I saw. This Minion one. And I was like, huh, it's a really big bag. I don't know what the inches is, but it's the large version. And basically, on the tag, that's what's on the bag. It's so pretty. I thought, maybe I can cut it down and use it for crafting in some way. Um, because I'm not using this big old bag right now for anything else. Like, Or if you're going to Disney and you want you know some Disney bags this might work this might work for Universal as well um, but I got it strictly for crafting and then the next bag that I saw was this frozen one and again I was like can I use this in another way so there's Elsa and what is his name Anna's boyfriend Kristoff Kristoff there's no Anna and then um, Olaf but it says believe in the journey so i believe this is from frozen 2 but it's really really pretty and it's a very large bag so if you're doing like a frozen birthday or anything that will work and then guys hold your seats hold your seats so then i saw this one and i was like sold look at the um toy story you guys know I'm in love with Forky. Look at Forky right there. I was like, what? What? The alien. Like, I was in love. Sold. Slinky dog. I was sold. So, once I saw this, I was like, yep, I'm buying them all. So, I did pick up three bags that I didn't really need. So, let me know if you had a favorite item in this haul. I would love to know. Until next time, guys. Thanks for stopping by. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.